Only temporary, higher bills are forcing one family to make some tough decisions. News 10's Caitlin Hunt has their story and explains how relief could be on the way. These days, it seems every press of the thermostat is another dollar leaving your wallet. And that's how one local family feels after seeing a sharp increase in their energy bill. The McCoy family in Dana, Indiana is like most families. Dad Larry works for the city and mom Amy helps care for Andrew, who has several disabilities. But the recent increase in their Duke energy bill has left them feeling concerned. Around about 600 to over 1,000, now it's over 2,000. Probably be about 3,000 next time. The McCoys aren't sure why this increase is happening, but their provider Duke Energy did give me an explanation. Spokesperson Angeline Protegeri says many customers saw larger bills recently. Um, they may be seeing the effect of the a higher volume of energy usage because of those very cold stretches we had in December. Protegeer says all the holiday lights and decorations could have also contributed to increases, but there are other year-round factors that go into a utility bill. There are two main factors that go into a utility bill, the electric rate that you're charged and the volume of energy that you use. These rates are adjusted four times a year based on cost of fuel and purchase power. Protegeer says global demand caused both of these factors to increase, causing higher utility rates in the past year. Still, she says rates should be lower in coming months. Here in January, February, and March, we received approval for about a 5.5% decrease um, in customer fuel cost rates, purchase power rates that should help bring some relief to customer bills. And hopefully that's good news for the McCoys. So that way maybe we can afford the lights and get the bill paid and be able to have extra money to do stuff with kids. Duke Energy says there are several ways to keep your energy costs low. Keep your thermostat at the lowest possible setting, change your filters regularly, check the temperature on your water heater, and open your blinds on warm sunny days. In Terre Haute, Caitlin Hunt, News 10. Very interesting.